Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2019 Bowman Draft Baseball Jumbo Edition 8-Box. Pick your team number 17. Man, I've done 17 of these? How many thousands of cards is that, you think? That's a lot. Someone do that math. There it is. On the 17th, Bowman Draft Baseball. Ken with quadruple last spot mojo. That's why he has stars next to his name. This is our nice new camera that we have here. Make sure you're watching at 70, 720p. 60 frames per second, ladies and gentlemen. Man, that's quality. Quality. Wow. We may crank. Whoa, football mixer is posted. There's a Star Wars promo attached to that very football mixer. So check it out on jazbeescasebreaks.com. I have spoken. There's another Mandalorian episode tonight, folks. Usually it's on Fridays, but because of the release of the new Star Wars movie, hence our promo. Is this the right one? Oh, it is. God, I hope so. It's our last one. So we'll have Nick Cam right over here. We'll set those closer to him so he can help rip these open and make this break an hour instead of... I guess an hour and 20, I think. An hour and 30, perhaps. We better be exercising our hands for you know what. Is that still going on? Yeah, but it's... What do you mean it's still going on? I don't know. We just I, got... In, we just got... I feel, we just got I feel like something... I feel like something like, uh, we weren't prepared for it. We canceled it. Stop. Cancel culture. You can be... You can be the pack tacker or something do, if you want. Do, We'll probably have to switch. Or you could be, you know, holding the fort down. I kind of want to go. Me and Jay saw him go. Is it open to the public? Can we bring our fans? No, I don't want to talk about it. We shouldn't be talking okay. about it. I shouldn't have brought it up. That's on you. Yeah. You put four o'clock. Not... You should put, you know... 4.45 or 5. What? What time is it right 3 now? 3.45. 3.45? Oh, boy. Yeah. <laughs> That's not going to happen. I wish. It's that for that event that I'm talking about. We're going to be like the Rocky. We should so make a... keep talking about it. We should it. make a TikTok that's like the Rocky theme. But it's opening packs. Okay, <laughs> yes. <laughs> and you can like follow me on a bike or something like that. Yeah. yeah Mojo Jojo. Yeah. New camera. Thank you. I'm glad you noticed. Thank you. Just, what? Yeah. Yeah. We're just trying to give you just every day. We're just trying to give you. Uh, we're working towards bringing you better production value. Got a new camera in lieu of Christmas bonuses here. Yep. Yeah, no Christmas bonuses. We're doing all doing this for you. We're we're a nonprofit at this point. <laughs> Chase Trump. No, we'll be for profit next year. I actually have two of these cameras now, so I gotta return. Do you really? One. Yeah. Oh. Chase Trump for the Cubs. That's gonna go to John Samuelson. Maybe eBay will get a setup like that. Ooh. That'd be sick. Just upgrade. New customers just up upgrades everywhere. You like that frame rate right there too? I can breeze through that paper. You can still get all the detail. Ooh. Paper doesn't ship, obviously. It numbered doesn't, paper it doesn't does. lose focus like the last doesn't time. lose focus oh. just holds oh. it right there it auto focuses anywhere i need remember it remember when i hit a super factor yesterday you, you hit guys, a super factor you guys can't hit super factors out of 30 cases i hit out of one that was crazy <laughs> that was wild actually the one day you fill in and then it's like oh super Damn. and then you're, you're the super factor guy out yeah, of this stuff out of bowman say, draft so <laughs> yeah. yeah someone said it was red the cases that we're oh, yeah. Remember that kid on Instagram who was just like, I don't know how, but it must be rigged somehow. Tops is sending Jaspies these cases. <laughs> All right. Out of 250, had, like, Matt Walner. That kid probably ripped like two boxes and he was just like, where's my, team, which is brutal. where's my super fractor? <clears throat> The traded teams. That's why I tell people not to trade. That was a traded team. Are you serious? Mm -hmm. But then the Super Factor bounty ended up going to Rick. So oh. it was like kind of crazy. That's kind of weird. Okay. Yeah, it was really weird. 
Well, I guess the, the car god said. Yeah, here you go. It'll, yeah, it'll, it'll, it'll all be fine. It'll all work out. I've spoken. I can't believe once we saw the paper base that the entire break fits into that. Right. Mm -hmm. All right. Onwards. Maybe Bowman breaks would be quicker now. I know. 41 out of 150. Actually, yeah, we might shave a few minutes. Brady McConnell. I'm glad I didn't wear that NASA shirt today. Oh, man. If we were... I would just kept hoodie on. Brady with... And we'll do an autograph recap at the end as well. Brady McConnell going to Ken Goldberg and the Royals. Tua Tungo Viola, number four to the Dolphins in Todd McShay's draft. First round. Yeah, I think he had Joe Burrow, number one. Is that yeah. true? Yeah. Is that going to happen? Yeah. That's good for the hobby. He's a GOAT. Matt Wallner to 99. Is LSU going to like win the whole thing? LSU, it's pretty wide open. You know, Ohio State's pretty good, undefeated. You know, you got Clemson in there. You can't mess with Clemson, you know. Dabo. And I like, then you got I like uh, Dabo. That yeah. other team, Oklahoma, which I don't know. Oklahoma's think. in here. I think Oklahoma gets out of four ninety nine. Smoke, but we'll see. Oklahoma's defensive issues, I feel like. Very you know, they score a ton of points. Yeah, I like Oklahoma but I don't know what the spread is. What's that? Bengals, yeah, Bengals are getting Joe Burrow. They'll he's, probably take the quarterback, yeah. He's from Ohio too. I don't know if Ryan Finley moved the needle for You'd rather have Bengals. Herbert? Over Burrow? Jake Fromm? I would take Burrow over both of those guys, but... You know. Maybe maybe one of those QBs falls to the Raiders. Uh, Raiders. You want a new quarterback? Uh, yeah, Raiders aren't going to take... They're not going to take a quarterback in the first round, yeah. McShay said, said a corner... And then a wide receiver with the Bears. I don't know. You guys can't draft cornerbacks, Gary and Conley. And then you can't draft receivers, Amari no. Cooper. Although, Amari Cooper's good now that he's not on the Raiders. There's Noah Song. Both of those guys were not Gruden picks. Though. Maybe re-sign Amari Cooper. That'd be hilarious, actually. There's Christian Robinson to 150 blue paper. Noah Song goes to John and the Red Sox. Lens is nice too. You can zoom in too on the lens. You can buy different lenses now if you wanted to. See that? You'd be like, whoa, whoa! Look at that Bowman style. Wow. You can definitely spot parallels there for sure. <laughs> I know now people are gonna be like, oh, Joe, you missed a numbers card. Yeah, like, oh, <laughs> there it is. Yeah. Yeah, that'd be helpful. Yeah. It'd be helpful. Nick, you're breaking the wrong box. If we had the camera yesterday, that wouldn't have happened. Wouldn't have happened. Wouldn't have happened. <laughs> Has anyone been out of shape over there? Do you know? Is everyone okay? I think everyone. Okay. Everyone seemed like they were okay. Yeah. Yeah, <coughs> yeah Sean. We've upgraded our life. Upgraded our camera life. This is Cameron Cannon. Optics not till Friday, so rookies and stars will break tonight. Yeah, as soon as it fills. Optic won't be until Friday. So I'd say rookies and stars. Yeah, you can put your eye through the little eye hole and see it. Uh huh. Everything looks good from this eye hole. Okay, here. that's good. Everything looks good. All the angles angles are good. Okay, good. We need All right. A Producer, a sound producer, and a video coordinator. So have someone holding a boom mic up over our heads for eight hours. For eight hours, yeah. And even when you like take a break, that nope. they have They'd to still be here. Yeah. We should have a Keeping Up with the Kardashians themed show for Jaspies. Reality show? Yeah. Sure. 
I think people would watch it. Yeah. What do we call it? I don't know. Keeping up with the jazz piece? Inside the shop. Inside the shop? There has to be some sort of card pun to it, right? Can, can there be, like, inside the packs? Inside the boxes? Unwrapped jazz piece. Unra jazz piece unwrapped? Jazz piece unwrapped. There we go. See, no, we're that's a Food Network show. Oh, is it? Yeah. I do love, maybe the Food Network will do it. Guy Fieri. There's Christian Robinson again. Have you ever seen Paper. Guy Fieri not like something on the Diner Drivers and Dives? That no, shows such a sham. No, he goes... He's never said, oh, I don't like that, man. I think he just goes to only places that he knows he'll like. He's not, He's not like... You know what reviewing I mean? It? Yeah, he's not reviewing. He's just like, I just like this place. I'm gonna eat this stuff. I don't know, but you can't possibly like everything that apparently, he's tried. Apparently, he does. There's got to be something he did. There like. has to be a twist to it. I think he should. He needs to show up to some random place. Yeah. But then he, I don't. I think he, his brand is. He doesn't want to be the guy that like puts down a business and. That's dumb. You know, doesn't want to be. Doesn't want to be a food critic. And he's a Raiders fan. What a loser. Total Raiders fan. Awesome. Trisha up at training camp. Yeah, on Hard Knocks. It was on Hard Knocks. It was great. And I think his son was there, too, with him. Something like that. Maybe he wasn't. Yeah, I don't know. So. But his son, his son was, like, totally embarrassed of his dad. He's like, oh, man. You're still frosting the tips of your hair. You're trying to, trying to like... Dap up all these like football players. God, you're embarrassing me. Dad. Not cool. And the camera looks clean. The camera looks so nice. Clean. The best purchase and it's ever. It's a clean HDMI, so you don't see any of the you know, yeah. There's the no stats on there. Yeah. On the camera. No, it's nice and clean. It's kind of hard to turn on, but that's the only thing. Put it. Don't I just press that on off button? Yeah, but it's like. It's kind of weird. You gotta go through the menu and stuff sometimes. Mm -hmm. I'll live with that. Yeah. I like that there isn't like a big door that's hanging right yeah. here. <laughs> Alright. Oh, no. Yeah. <laughs> You see all that? Remember that? That's the time. Remember that? We're gonna all have to. I'm gonna have to clean my fingernails more. Cut yeah, them every I, I day. Actually just <laughs> no more hot Cheetos. Yeah. No more. We have to. We have to eat like cheese puffs with a fork. Ryan Nelson, Eric with the diamond manicures. Bags. We, should, we, should, should, manicures. Should, we put, should we put manicures on the Jaspi budget? Manicures. Pedicures feet. Pedicures feet. We can, yeah, we can. We can work that in there too. Yeah. I don't want people to touch my feet, really. Mm. Maybe well, hands. Just, just manicure, know. then. Isn't there, a, isn't there a place next door? Do they massage your hands? I hope some places do. I need a deep tissue hand massage. I could use one of those. Let's. There's a place next... Let's go to the place next to the van store. And be like, do you guys do hands? That's a Robert Kraft place. <laughs> you, don't, you think that's a Robert Kraft place? Yeah. Uh, it is. Uh, I think when you go in there and say, do you guys do hands... <laughs> the 250, Brett Beatty for the Mets. I don't know. We'll have to look up the Yelp reviews, see if it's a craft place or not. I don't know. They're they're. I mean, just look at the look at the people going there. You'd be like, oh, okay, yeah. These. Robert Kraft yeah. <laughs> like That's Ro on their Yelp page. it's Robert Robert Kraft's Yelp profile. No, like Yelp, they don't have any reviews or anything. Out of but it's just a photo of Robert Kraft standing in front of it. Just thumbs with up. A big smile. Yeah, it's like oh, right. He should do reviews of massage places. He should. Out of one fifty, Kyle Stowers. Yes, of course. Yeah. I don't know what everyone else is thinking. I don't know either. out of the gutter. There's Jack Kakanovitz. 68 out of 150 for the Halos. EA with the Angels. It's in the game. It's in the game. You got your PlayStation hooked up for Thursday, Jason? Hooked up ready to run right now. 
Whoa. Whoa. Party? No, I got it here. We can play Madden, then we can do a Mario Kart for sure. I, I need to find my Switch. Find your Switch. Man, you have... Well, I got Mandalorian you tonight, so I got a pregame for that. <laughs> <laughs> for real, I got a... I know, I, I know my Christmas gift for you this year. A Switch? No. A Switch yeah. tracker? No. A tracker? Yeah. How many, I, the tile, um, that's exactly yeah. what I'm, okay. Can you put those little stickers yeah, right on like your keys, yeah. your yeah. switch? Yeah, yeah. Because yeah, yeah. the only thing you don't lose is your phone, so yeah. boom. You yeah. just track it on your phone, you know where everything is. Easy. Easy. All right. Oh, all the blocks are done. Thanks, Nick, for that. And onwards, ladies and gentlemen. You know what there should be is a pause button. Oh, that'd be good to look up. 145 out of one, just because the pause button's so tiny on the... They make ones that are the size of the computer screen. With these? Yeah, like 30 buttons. I don't know if they need that. No, that's excessive. I barely use more than like four here. Yeah. Yeah, I thought we'd use a tweeting one for them, but I don't know. It'd, it'd be better if you could like, schedule them. 82 out of 99, Brandon Williamson. Mariners, that'll be for John McCall. So this side will be completed pile here. I'm just kind of sorting out the paper as we go. What has to sell out before Star Wars Tellers breaks? Well, everything. Um, all the breaks that are on the Star Wars Stellar promotion, there's a list of the breaks where we're giving away spots. So obviously we've got to do those breaks to give away the spots. And then we have to maybe sell another handful of spots straight up. And then we're in Stellar Breaks. But hopefully we'll do that some point this week. Hopefully with all the movie hype, people will be into it. And Mandalorian hype has been strong. So a lot of good, lot of good Star Wars happening here, and then hopefully we can bust that case open and see a lot of nice stuff there. Tops has had the Star Wars license for a long time. One hundred eight out of four ninety nine. Jonathan Ornelius, they got a long history with Lucas Films. For the Rangers. And we've got Dre Jameson. Will there be any spoiler cards in Stellar? No. I don't think so. I think I think they're all previous movies. Nick says no, I heard him in the background. There's Dre Jameson, Diamondbacks for Eric J. Whoa. People are spoiling it already? Yeah. I saw it, I almost my heart dropped when I saw it on Twitter and then I X out immediately. Just X out immediately and just mind wipe, just forget about it. I just, it was like this big red blob. I don't know. Just go. You just go and do something else. Once. What? That's not that bad. That's pretty long. Yeah. If they they uh, I don't know how people sat through Irishman in the theater. Yeah, that's a home. That's watch. That's chill at home and watch that. Bryce and Stott, five out of seven. It's not like Goodfellas. It's just not a great I mean, Goodfellas is, is pretty good. It's not Wolf of Wall Street was my favorite. Scorsese. Five out of 75. Yeah, that that's that's like a modern Scorsese classic. It's pretty great. And 
Yeah. Yeah. All right, we got Eric Rivera to 499, 224 out of 499. What up, Brian? What's going on? You had a 20 card to T submission pop at PSA today. Five Mac at Oz got four nines and an eight. Seven Optic Autos got all nines. Eight various top Chrome Autos got four tens. Three nines and an eight. Bummed about all the nines. I thought, hmm. Yeah, I wish you got a few more of those tens. The Immaculates are tough. Five, five Immaculate Autos got four nines. The Optic and the Chrome should be, those should be, I feel like you should have had a little more tens there. We got Domingo Avezado, 250 purple paper, and then more, or purple chrome, purple paper, and then more. The optics are all coming back at nine. You would think you, you would think you would get some, uh, you would get some more ten out of that optic too. So we're gonna drink on Thursday when buys four logs. Four logs would just go nuts. <laughs> the pre. Pre 2012 ones. <laughs> I seen them on, the, on Amazon the other day. Oh yeah. Like the old ones. What are they? Yeah. What the old formula? What are they selling those for? I, I, I don't know. Probably well, way well, too well, much. Oh man, you'd I go. That. You'd go nuts. You would have had a heart attack. All right. Have you seen the girls, the movie Girls Girls Trip? No, no? I have not. Is that with Kristen Wiig? No, that's like the one with the Queen Latifah and then like... Oh yeah, I heard of that. That actually looks kind of funny. It looks funny. It looks like a funny thing, man. 83 out of 499, Noah Song. Another one for John. <laughs> no, my, I wish, Mike Tower, but no, no. No one asked the Mandalorian if he paints houses. It was, it was in the... Uh, Irishman. All right, there is Jose Devers, Raphael's cousin, to four ninety nine. I think the one guy was better in Home Alone. That's my Joe Pesci was better in Home Alone. Someone had a wild, uh, a wild Home Alone theory that those two guys were, were in a parallel universe. Oh yeah, I heard that one. They were. So. Like Back to the Future. I don't know how how I don't know how they did that. Hi Ron. Yeah, we'll we'll look uh we'll look at your email. We look at all the emails. There's Davis Wenzel. Rangers, that'll go to Patrick. Uh, the de aging did not seem not not to me anyway seemed distracting in the Irishman, but I don't I don't really have a good eye for that, so so I think uh, maybe I'm not the best person to ask about that because uh, apparently it did bother some people, but I didn't really notice. I was just so caught up in the the Scorsese narrative. But don't listen to people, folks. That say it's it's. If you like Scorsese, if you like that genre, I think you'll you'll enjoy it. It's a slow burner. I didn't, uh... But it don't 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 get caught up with the people who are saying like ah oh, it's it's good fellas. You know, it's not. I haven't seen an email from 
Oh. Sometimes it goes to updates and that stuff. Oh, it goes to my order sometimes. I look at order. My email is Jackson's Or the other one. Yeah, Jackson's Jackson. And the nice CJ Abrams. Who's got the Padres in this one? Ken Goldberg picked up the Padres. Nice C.J. Abrams. And yeah, that, it looks like a variation. 50 57 out of 99. So there you go. 57 out of 99. That's pretty nice. Sixth overall pick. Uh-oh, cool. Well, t today's the day. They're due, right? The, the 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 gambler's fallacy. They're due. They gotta be due. Let's move this paper out of the way here. Finish off this box. What is that orangey looking? Or it looks like gold paper, maybe. There you go. Keone Cavaco, 28 out of 50 gold paper. That card is gold. Michael Tran with the Minnesota Twins. There you go, Mike. That's chrome. We'll save those. And there's the paper. Right. 224 out of 250, Corbin Carroll, purple paper. I'll slide this stack over here. And you can see the three remaining stacks on the uh, top camera over there. Ooh, look at this. Bowman's 30th anniversary autograph. 75 out of 99. That's pretty cool. Astros. Who's got the Strohs in this? Ken Goldberg, one of his last spot mojo teams. Gets this insert auto right here. That's Seth Beer, Astros edition. There you go, nice. Um, yeah, Coop has a little financial interest in the Lakers, which he's now starting to regret. It's a short number, though, thankfully. And we've got Chase Strumpf to 499, 130 out of 499 for John Samuelson and the Cubs. Got a couple Cubs autos there, and we'll remember we'll do a recap at the end too. So if you're just joining us, we will uh, do an autograph recap at the end of this video. And we've got, out of 250, we've got uh, Shervin Newton, Purple Chrome, for the Mets. Ken with the Mets. Pick Newton. Like Pick Newton. 
No, I'm not a Fig Newtons guy. What? You like Fig Newtons? Wait, say it again. You do not like Fig Newtons? I do not right? like Fig Newtons. Are the, is this a Fig Newton Christmas party? I might just buy some and that's, <laughs> that's our dinner. <laughs> That'd be dinner? Starve, then. How do you not like Fig Newtons? Yeah, they're, they're not for me. That's the... I don't know. Jason, you like Fig Newtons? What is it? It's Fig Newtons. From the, from it's like, like the only fruit I. You don't know what a Frig Newton is. No, it's I like, not know that. It's what? like a, it's like a it's like a jam from a fig tree. Oh. Yeah, it's the only fruit I eat. The only really? fruit so I eat out of four ninety nine. No, it's called a Fig Newton. Oh, cause my dad, my dad eats fig, but it's fancy called eagle. I don't know. Yeah. I've never eaten this jam like that. So yeah, they're like in the oh, middle of a, they're in the middle of the cookie. I'm not know. talking about eagles. I'm talking oh, about like fig the ones. It's a candy bar called Fig Newton. It's, a can- it's not really a candy bar, is it? Well, it's sold next to the candy bar. It's like a... It's, like yeah. a, it's, a, it's, it's, it's supposed to be a tree. No, it's not all natural. It's sugar. No, I don't have no idea. It's good American sugar. I don't know. I might have to put a poll up. <laughs> yeah, put up a poll. Let's get let's get the... Is the poll... Have you ever heard of a Fig Newton? Or is it... The do poll is, like do you like Fig Newtons? Okay. What does Teddy have? Teddy, you hear us? What do, you, do you like Fig Newtons? Not really. Yeah, see? 101 out of 150, Jeter Downs, former Reds prospect now with the Dodgers. Blue paper. What, did you make your own Fig Newtons? Yeah. Michael with the... Uh, okay. Michael with the Blue Jays. Uh... Yeah, well, I mean they are cookies, trendsetter. But the the filling inside is the is fig. The fruit from the tree of fig. There's Matt Gorski uh, for the Pirates at Costa Ken. What's up, Eastwood? Eastwood's asking if anyone's getting in on Origins Hoops tomorrow. I hope so. Because I like... Uh, oh, are we going live early? Yeah. Oh, nice. 41 out of 99, Luke and Baker for the Cardinals Green Chrome. Yeah, the filling's like, uh, like jam. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Mike Tower... Looks like they also have strawberry Newtons. I could see, I could do a strawberry Newton. Aren't they like the Knox ones? The Knox Bear Farm ones? Is that what I'm thinking of? No. They have strawberry in it. There's Josh Smith Purple Paper. Hmm, I, could, I could do a strawberry Newton. Yeah, you've seen it. You've definitely seen it before. But it's not something I regularly get. I don't think about it. Oh, I've seen those, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My dad eats those actually. Yeah, they taught, get some fig fig jam in there. Yeah, my, there is strawberry ones, Joe. There's also Ooh, like see, I can do a strawberry one. That sounds good. Yeah, that's true. He does. Um, who said anything about PB and J Transcender? That that's solid. Crunch all the way. Though. Yeah, that 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 is awesome. Crunchy peanut butter, Oz. Ooh, a Wayne Newton? I'm okay with a Wayne Newton. Does he still perform in Vegas? There used to be all those big signs on the way to Vegas. Wayne Newton at the Stardust. Some Cam Newtons? Yeah, why isn't Cam Newton on the Fig Newton sponsorship bandwagon? It's a missed marketing opportunity, Cam. There's Brett Beatty. Autograph for Ken and the Mets. You know what's also good though? P PB and J is good, but PB and Honey is also pretty good. So there's a little bit of dust on this penny sleeve here. Oh, no, it's, it's on the card right there. There it is, gone. P 
peanut butter and honey. That's a pretty good sandwich. Oh, Wayne Newton recently performed at Caesar's Palace. Oh, there you go. Why hasn't Wayne Newton gotten in on a on a Fig Newton sponsorship? Where are these Fig Newton advertising dollars going? Do they have advertising dollars? When's the last time there's been a Fig Newton ad? Are figs just out of favor with the kids these days? Do Fig Newtons need a rebrand? There's so many fig questions now. All right, we've got out of 499, Matthew Allen, paper, 499. And we've got Michael Toglia, 180 out of 250. Purple Chrome autograph for the purple team. Rockies goes to Ken. Yeah, that's right. That's a good one, trendsetter. Yeah, got a fig. You're it out. Fig it. Yeah, fig it. Yeah, see, we've we've come up with all sorts of advertising, advertising campaign for Fig Newton already. Who owns Fig Newton? Sounds like a Nestle company. You know, East would say too many, too many delicious snacks nowadays. There is. You know, so poor Fig Newtons just get just get pushed to the the bottom the bottom rack in the checkout aisle, just hiding in the bottom. There's Jake Mangum. more boxes after this one ladies and gentlemen almost there stay on target almost there oh wow look at this draft pick breakdown Adley Rushman autograph 36 out of 99 for the Orioles Ken Goldberg with the O's nice Looks nice. You can see the 35 out of 99 just above the Bowman Chrome logo. There it is. It's pretty good. And we've got Peyton Burdick, 113 out of 150, blue paper. Two twenty eight out of two fifty, Grayson Rodriguez, purple chrome. And then some more paper right here. All right. Well, what do we have on the? What are we watching on TV here? What should we watch? There's something. There's some special on the ESPN, and I'm not sure what's happening here. Some, maybe some basketball. Maybe we'll start with NBA TV and just kind of work our way around from there. Is Lakers and Pacers on right now? Oh, they won't be on the NBA network because it'll be on my network here. Spectrum. 
to go. Lakers up 13-16. And we got two boxes to go. All right, and there's Alec Manoa for the Blue Jays. That goes to Ken. Yeah, everyone else, if you're not in L.A., you'll have Lakers at Pacers on the NBA TV. And it's on Spectrum if you're in the Los Angeles area. We got a Riley Green Orange, 19 out of 25. That's a nice one for Ken and the Tigers. Ken got a lot of teams in this one. Your fifth overall pick. Out of 250, we got Jamari Baylor, purple chrome. And Bo Phillip for the Braves, 242 out of 499 for EA and the Braves. There you go, Eric. Two forty-two out of four ninety-nine. Top right corner. Nice autograph from Bo Phillip. And we got Michael Bush. For the Dodgers. That's for Michael. Michael with Michael. Thirty first overall pick. One more box after this, ladies and gentlemen. We're almost there. We got Brent Rooker to 499 for uh, the Twins. Michael with the Twins. Jeter Downs, 63 out of 150, blue chrome for the Dodger Blue. Corbin Carroll, green paper, 52 out of 99 for Eric J and the Diamondbacks. Those are just 
his facsimile autographs, as you know. All right, one more box to go. And we'll put this break away. We'll go through some more orders, and then we'll see what else we can get into tonight. Also, how many spots are we giving? We're giving away one spot in Star Wars Stellar in this break. Bryson Stott. Alexa, dim the lights. Okay. Oh, no, 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 Dad, I need your help. What did you do? Burnt the dock. That's a duck. <laughs> what do you have in that cabinet? Some spaghetti. Okay, chop up some garlic. Your mom cooked up for me once. Did she burn it? Of course she did. Of course she did. That was beautiful. There you go. How do I look? Perfect. All right, Philly, is that'll be for uh, uh, Jeff Goldberg with that one. Some paper here. And you know what that means? Incredible year end savings on a huge selection of our most popular models. We'll do the autograph recap right at the end of this, too, and then do the dice roll for the Star Wars spot. 15 out of 19, Shea Langiers. Green paper for the Braves. That'll be for, uh, for EA and the Bravos. Fifteen out of ninety-nine on that one. And 193 out of 250, Matt Cantorino. And that'll be for Michael and the Twins. There's Tyler Callahan to 4.99. Nice, Curtis. Thank you. 26 out of 150. Jordan Adams, Angels. Yeah, Curtis bought the rest. No, he said he got in some breaks. And then uh, watching the Last Jedi. Fingers crossed for some stellar spots. Powering through that marathon, Curtis. Nice. Reds with the Tyler Callahan, almost do done. All in, one night. all in one night, just go sleepless. I don't know. Do you need it in there? I get some newer. Uh, At least the newer ones, I think. Someone said you can watch it chronological order. Yeah, I don't know what to do, and then I never did it because I didn't. I was confused. People said to watch it release date, and people said to watch it chronological. I I would I would watch it by release date. But I've already done it. Then go chronological. I'm just going to watch the... Are they all on Disney Plus or not the new ones? It's all on Disney Plus? Uh, no, I think Last Jedi may still be on like Netflix because they still have that... I think there's still like a contract until X amount of time. Last time I had 4K. Oh, yeah. But, uh... <laughs> your Dolby Avo system, like, it's... Playing my Tesla on the screen. But so fast. So fast. Too quick. Josh Young, nice. That is for Patrick and the Rangers. 212 out of 250. Josh Young? I think it's Young. 
Or Jung? I don't know. Depends on how he wants to say it, I guess. Could be Yum as well. Who knows? Dutch, I think. All right. I think you could just watch Force Awakens and then Last Jedi and then just roll right into into Rise of Sky. You can skip it. There's a, we have that technology now. Yeah. <laughs> to skip right past the scenes you don't like. Uh, I might, yeah. Might buy a couple. That's it, ladies and gentlemen. All right, yeah, that's it. That's the last paper. Let's do the autograph recap. Pretty solid break, I want to say. We've got, got some big names here. We've got Josh Young. Pretty big name. We've got Adley Rushman. Pretty big name there. I like that autograph. The C.J. Abrams is strong. So pretty solid break. A lot of nice color here. Good parallels. I like the blue wave. And then we started off the break with Chase Strumpf. And there you go. That was 8-box jumbo picker team number 17 from jazbeescasebreaks.com. This is Joe, and I'll break more with you next time. Bye-bye.